have a situation. The FBI says there's an escaped fugitive heading our way. Got a psychopath in a Batmobile. I'm not gonna let them come through town without a fight. Very nice. What is the coolest car that you have either owned or driven in your life? I have a 1970 Cadillac Eldorado. <gasps> And I rarely get to drive it because it's always broke down, but when I get to drive it, I, I love it. What about you? I don't think that there's one. Uh, first of all, I have a tank. An you M4. have one? Yes. <laughs> I have a tank. And my, the tank that I was a tank driver with in the Austrian Army, it's an American tank, uh, a patent tank M47 from the 50s. So I have that, that one here out in the Melody Ranch. So that's a 50-ton tank, and it uh, is fantastic. I, I, I went over a car crashed it like nothing. I mean, so it's, it's really a fun vehicle to, to drive. So that's, so that's, not, that's number one. I used to have a cranberry red 1965 Mustang. I drove it from Oregon uh, all the way down, actually from, from Washington and down through and I came I, and uh, I bought it. I love that car. Can I go like old style? Please. Brazilian? Yes. Fusca. Wow. A Volkswagen Fusca, like the Beetle. That sounds like you're but swearing at me. Time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. It's a compliment. <laughs> well, thank you. Can I talk about motorcycles instead? Please. <laughs> okay. I was like, I drive a Prius. Uh, so <laughs> I have a, a 2005 Bonneville Triumph. Ooh. Bonneville. Yeah. I actually don't take it on the freeways. I take it on the side roads. I'm really responsible with it because those things are dangerous, especially in L.A. But I like to just cruise, you know, go grab a coffee, go for a drive, you know. You cannot take the coffee with you on the bike. No, 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 no. That's why I do espresso really quick. Get on the bike. <laughs> Shot and go. Of coffee, of espresso. Let's right. clarify. In the movie, we have a whole bunch of vehicles. Uh -huh. that, that Corvette goes over 200 miles an hour. We have the Camaro that goes like 180 miles an hour. We have all these cars that are like five, 600 horsepower. And it was a lot of fun to do the chase scenes because we have so many of the chases, yeah. especially to go through that cornfield, corn not field, knowing right. at all where to go. And here, of course, Johnny is the comic relief in the movie. I mean, he <laughs> does an extraordinary job to, to, to really make people laugh. Yeah, nice helmet, the by movie. the way. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah, the helmet, exactly. <laughs> yeah. That's why we love making movies, mm -hmm. because you can be a little kid again and play around with all those cars and drive fast and have fight scenes and shootouts and blow-ups and uh, that machine gun. Oh, the, that was the, so the Nazi good. killer that yeah. you call. I mean, that was fantastic. I mean, he was feeding in the gun belt. Just the power. Oh, just the power, oh, power, just the power yeah. yeah. It's insane. And just being able to do a shootout scene with Arnold Schwarzenegger, I was just like, I was falling out of character so much. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you couldn't tell. Have you guys ever gotten a speeding ticket? Passing stops or red lights. Oh. I mean, we have a, I mean, do you do a California roll through a stop sign? It depends. Ah. Yeah. I mean, if I see that there's no traffic coming, I mean, yeah, I mean, probably. Am I going to have to do a citizen's arrest? Yeah, you can do it. <laughs> Go ahead. I don't know what you do. <laughs>